I will never see her get married. I will never see her graduate from school. A family trying to make sense of the senseless. It's terrible. It should never have happened. An innocent baby murdered. She was a beautiful baby. And her accused killer is her dad. I hope to God they rip him to shreds. Tonight, we're learning that father is no stranger to law enforcement, arrested almost 10 times in the last several years. CBS 4's Hank Tester joins us live from the Northwest Miami-Dade Jail, where he's being held tonight. Hank? Well, Ruta Bay, you might remember, this is the second night in a row we've been standing in front of the jailhouse doing a story about horrible things done to young kids by adults. This is quite a story. It's gut-wrenching. Let's take a look. A moment of joy, a father, mother, and just born baby girl named Harlow. Harlow born a little early, but beginning life okay. Now. I will never see my niece start school. I will never see her get married. I will never see her graduate from school. Little four month old Harlow dies a horrific death. Police say her father did it. The father told detectives the baby was being fussy. That's Juan Antonio Gonzalez in bond court facing a murder rap of the worst kind. Affidavits say he caused his four month old, old daughter to suffer multiple skull fractures and severe brain injuries, fractured arm and leg, dislocated elbow and multiple fractured ribs. And the victim, the child unfortunately died. I hope they kill him in jail. I hope they rip him to shreds. That's what he deserves. Nine different mug shots representing nine arrests since 2009 for Juan Antonio Gonzalez, including battery, battery on a pregnant woman, robbery, marijuana possession, and now murder linked to child abuse. Gonzalez made news last October when a fire was set at a halfway house where he was the caretaker. I saw smoke in the roof. I started running across the house. I was telling everybody, get out, get out, get out. The child's aunt telling CBS 4's Peter Dench that she Baker acted her sister, Avis, little Harlow's mom. The mom now in a mental hospital. And I'm shocked that my sister is not in jail. I'm shocked because she was present. It was an apartment smaller than my living room. And I'm surprised that she's not being charged with anything. And that mom remains in hospital tonight. No bond granted in this case. Reporting, I'm Hank Tester, CBS 4 Tonight.